Hey everybody, it's Budget Bug Out coming to you with an unboxing video. This time, the Azula neck knife. Uh, I received the Blade HQ exclusive uh, Azula One with the uh, fire red coating. As you can probably tell by the the um, uh, name of the video. Alright, pretty excited, not gonna lie. Been waiting for this little guy. It only uh, took a couple days to arrive, so I'm pretty uh, pretty happy with Blade HQ. Right, I'm not sure what kind of personal information is going to be in here, if any. It's my first unboxing video like this. Oh, yes. Awesome. Fire Red Azula with kit. Made in the US of A. <clears throat> I'm excited. This is this will be not my first neck knife, but uh, it's gonna be my first good neck knife with um, the sole purpose of really just being a neck knife and maybe a little bit of survival kit. Um, as you can, as you can kind of tell, um, has some items in here. Oh yes, this is, I can already tell, you know, this grip is unlike, um, my other you know, neck knives. I, I can, I can already feel the quality in it. Nice. Let me see here. It's got a little bit of uh, spine jimping. Um, so you got a little serial number. It says USA, SE knives. The uh, Azula was uh, named after the bullet ant. As you can see, a little ant right there. Um, that's what the natives call the, um, the bullet ant in um, South America. They call it the Azula with a different spelling. But same pronunciation from my understanding. This is, it feels pretty light. I'll put all the specs in the description below. Let's see here. I'm trying to see the, the sharpness of it. Let's see here. No, you can, you can shave some hair, yep. I, uh, I always get all of my knives uh, professionally sharpened. Oops, sorry, it's out of focus. Um, so I will definitely get this in, uh, I'll get this sharpened for sure. And then let's look at some of the uh, items. I'm gonna be wearing this today to the movies. I'm about to, about to leave to go to the movies, so I just wanna do this real quick. Um, we got some paracord, um, it's green. Um, this looks like, I forget what type of attachment this is, but I'll try to include this in the description as well. But this is supposed to clip into like Molly and Alice type of stuff, from my understanding. Um, we got a little magnesium striker. Uh, whistle. This goes with this. Um, through, and it, it can attach to the ends of these. So you can wrap, you can wrap this up, and then the little bit of da that that's dangling, you can put the whistle on. Okay. The things I've talked about. Uh, this can clip to the sheet, the sheath itself. This is a little uh, the carabiner, I guess you would call that. Uh, let's see here, and these little guys go also in the sheath and it can connect the sheath to this little uh this little clip which and this clip can clip to your belt as well and this little guy you can use this um, in accordance with the necklace you can put it at the end like if you however you want to wear this oops it's not the wrong thing however you want to wear this 
um, you can put the ends through this little guy. Alright guys, so this is my video. Um, I'm just going to put this together and just I'm just going to wear it as a neck knife at first and then I'm going to eventually use it. Wow, that's a really good retention. Um, I'll eventually use it, you know, put a, a, implement a survival kit into it. Um, Y'all can feel free to check out my other survival kit, uh, neck knife. You can see kind of, wow, that's great retention. Um, you can kind of see what I do with uh, with neck knives, but for a while I just want to use this as a neck knife because, I mean, this is, I mean, it's the Azula. It's by SE Knives. So, um, leave comments or suggestions in, um, in the comment section and, uh, oops, and I will be sure to, uh, to reply to them. Any, uh, any input is welcome. I'm pretty new to, to neck knives. So y'all have a great weekend. See ya.